Even Joe hasn't turned up. Joe is always here at 11. Proper old geezer, cockney from the toes up, one of life's good people. Huge teeth. White hair, ludicrous grin, and a joy that slaps you in the face until you can't help but smile at it. Even the fucking furniture loves Joe. I swear the door swings open voluntarily when he arrives, if only to give the man an entrance. Suddenly he'll just be there. Crash! It almost clatters off its hinges with the force of it. Nothing touches Joe. He's invincible. You can hear him bellowing, Hello, sweet pea! to the whole street before he swaggers in, long white hair blowing behind him, cut off checkered trousers, white t shirt, braces dripping wet from the rain, all, oh, What magic! What a beautiful morning! Our car, our car should get over how glorious it is out there. <laughs> Lucky to live, eh? Lucky to live. I don't know what he does. I just know he comes in at 11. Usually. I find myself watching the door. I never really noticed he was such a regular when Boo was here, but now. But then it's okay, because I see his silhouette take up the window and wait for the door to crash open, but today it just flops to its side with a whimper, and Joe limply shuffles to the counter. I'm not prepared for this. <laughs> 